everybody. So nice to see you guys again. I'm going to show you exactly how it looks inside the quality assurance study guide. So if you are a dental hygienist who is taking the quality assurance exam and you don't know where to start, how to study, what to study, guess what? I can help you. Sorry, that was my puppy. She's playing with something. Princess, this is what happens when you work from home, you guys. Oh, you have a toy, play with that. <laughs> Sorry, guys. So if you guys look at my screen, um, notice on the left-hand side. So you will see all the different topics. I can zoom in for you guys. Can I zoom in? There we go. So if you look on the left-hand side, you see all the different topics. I give you everything you need to prepare for your quality assurance exam. I give you PowerPoints to read. I give you PDF files. And there's also a video after each topic where I kind of explain the topic to you. I help you with studying and I go over the quiz answers and protocols. Cause if you are sorry, not protocols, um, answers and rationales. Cause if you guys notice on the left-hand side where it says quiz under every topic, um, I don't think I can show you here cause I didn't log in as a customer. I'm the admin here, but, um, Basically, each quiz has questions. It's an interactive quiz. So you can take the quiz and practice as many times as you want. It, it lets you know right away if you're right or wrong. But then if you notice on the bottom of each topic here, this um, cloud type icon, that is a video where I go over the answers and um, the rationales I talk about here. I'm just going to turn the sound off for a second but I go through the answers, the rationales, um, and I give you some study help. So I have all of that for you. Look at the different topics. So health and safety, emergency, community. We have infection control. There's a lot about infection control, pharmacology. And the best part too is if you click on just under the topic title, I'm going to do pharmacology. I clicked on test details. So I tell you what the percentage is per topic, how many questions, and that kind of helps you study a little bit too. You're not going to spend, you know, 10 hours studying pharmacology every day for a month if it's only 7% of the exam, right? So you're not going to do that. So I like to have that there for you. But look, all of the topics are here. You don't have to purchase a textbook and nothing I've done the hard work for you. So this is the quality assurance study guide. Um, it's a full course. I do go through the practice profile too. So I talk a little bit about that to give you guys help. I even have a video. I kind of help you guys. Um, I give you different practice profiles to kind of look at too. So you have an idea of what's a good practice profile and what's not a good practice profile. And the best part is if you feel like you have done your practice profile, and you don't know if it's if it's ready to be submitted, you don't want to fail, send it to me. So I do offer a full practice profile um, review as well, where I will actually mark it for you. So I'm just going to show you guys that link here. So the link is inside the course, um, but I can also leave it for you um, down below too, where I do offer full help. So I go over your entire practice profile one line by one line. I look through everything, everything. I send you a full report afterwards with what I feel you need to change in order to pass. You, you don't have to change anything if you don't want to, but even some things I'm going to highlight in red for you, what you need to change. And if you don't change them, you're likely going to get a call with the CDHO. So it's a great help if you feel you need help with that. You have full access to the course, to the um, quality assurance prep course until February, 2022. So if you sign up now, don't worry, no rush. You have until you have to take your exam. So you have full access till February, 2022. Cause if for some reason you haven't submitted it by, by February, 2022, you have an automatic fail. But having that said, um, you have full, full access to it until you don't need it anymore, basically. So if you need more time, just let me know and then you'll have full access to it anyway. So let me know you guys, if you have any questions, I am here to help. I'll leave the links for you down below for the quality assurance prep course and the practice profile review. I'm doing a lot of that now for the practice profiles. It does take me a week or two at the most to review them. So please be patient, but if you need it sooner, 
you guys. Oh, my lip is itchy. Sorry, guys. If you need it sooner, let me know. I can put a rush on it. No extra charge, but I'm getting a lot this time of year. So do it before the holidays because it's kind of nice to get it done, right? So I'll leave the links for you down below. Let me know if any questions and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. I will talk to you soon.